with so many nice communities in Claremont, Florida, there's always something for everyone. One of the top communities is Kagan's Crossings. But what makes Kagan Crossings in Claremont such a great place to live? That's what we're going to get started on today. Hello everyone, I'm Chris Rico, and I'm a local real estate agent here in Orlando, Central Florida. My mission is to educate, simplify the process, and make you a real estate fan. So let's get started talking about Kagan's Crossings because the residents here, they don't need to go really far to get what they need and what they want because there is a town center and the town center is located right there in the middle of everything. You can find a range of shopping, and restaurants and a ton of things to do is there's a cat cafe and there's dentists and wellness centers and hair salons if you haven't had a chance to check out the cat cafe it is so much fun you have to book it in advance and all you do is um, go and pet cats it's so much fun it's so cute um, I'm a cat lover myself the Windsor K Resort community is opening soon and it's all new construction so this is your chance to live a luxury resort in a luxury resort community in Claremont. It has a water park, a pool, a nine hole mini golf course, and has a fitness center and sports facilities and even a bar and cafe. If you haven't seen other Windsor resorts as an indication of its splendor and attractive, how attractive it is for vacation homes, then check it out. Another one of the top benefits of Kagan Crossings is its proximity to Orlando because Kagan's Crossings is one of the best options if you want to live near Walt Disney World. The resort is just like 20, 30 minutes away from this community. Uh, you can hop on 192 from Route 27 and it makes that commute possible. There are also many other theme parks and attractions in Orlando. There's so much to do. The best part is that you can easily access all these attractions while living in a small, time vi small town vibe and overall just very peaceful community. Claremont has so much good shopping, but you don't need to go to, K you know, leave Caving Crossings to get all your shopping done. There's a town center, there's the community also has a farmer's market. The community farmer's market is held every Friday on the lawn in front of the Kagan Crossings Community Library. And it's an excellent place to shop for produce and baked goods, craft items, and more. The Kagan Crossings uh, Library also has a charging station for where you can charge your electric cars. The community also has a park to all its residents. It's called Lake Sylvia, and it's a one-acre park, small picnic tables and benches and grills. Uh, great to have a picnic, and also an observation deck overlooking the lake. If you'd like more information on Kagan's Crossings, make sure to email me your questions. Make sure you click the description below and you can find my email there. See you guys on the next one.